Hi guys and welcome to the new video. So I have some exciting news. I haven't been recording for such a long time because we've been extremely busy trying to sort things out. I have a pleasure to record today from our new home. It's all work in progress. So it's a gigantic mess. Big plans, big changes coming and I just want to share it with you, so <laughs> I will show you my, my completely new home. So right now we are in the bedroom and when we moved in uh, there was almost no AC here. The AC units were, I don't know if it's dusty or faulty, but the AC was not really working properly and the day that we moved in it was 49 degrees actually this month august is so hot it was i think a week ago or so there was a highest temperature recorded in uae this year and it was 50.8 uh, degrees so you can imagine no ac almost 50 degrees and carrying boxes so it was a struggle feeling hot, hot, hot. but most of the boxes are already in the house a big part is unpacked so i can show you around a little bit so as i said it's gonna be a gigantic mess the boys are here already enjoying their <laughs> their new bedroom same bed but a different place um we still haven't unpacked all the bags and a lot of things are just laying around Mm, but hopefully that will be sorted soon so as you see this is quite spacious bedroom and we also have a balcony here which is quite nice we we finally made the ac work we have big closets which is much nicer than the previous flat because we really struggle with uh, with sorting out the storage space uh, that's the bathroom and here we have a small issue because we don't have any cupboards even under the sink as you can see there's nothing there so all the all the things that we normally would have in the cupboards are just laying around for now uh, we also not really uh, liking the color of the walls or the bathtubs or the sink <laughs> Uh, this brownish color we want to change it so hopefully at some point we will be able to repaint it there's a lot of those small flaws like you can see this whole thing needs fixing and there's a lot of dirt on the ceiling we need to plaster all of those things there's a small leakage here as well but it's all fixable you know <laughs> I'll tell you in a moment, this is the shower, it also needs some painting and again some storage space. You know guys, initially the day that we moved in, um, we obviously were unpacking and sweating again 49 degrees and after the whole day we wanted to take a shower. But this whole house, uh, it's a house, it's not a flat. And this whole house was standing still without anybody living here for a while. Um, so no one was using the water, no one was using the gas. So when we first turned on the water and we were trying to just see if the sinks are working properly, if the water is running, it was completely brown and it stank so badly. And at first we thought we just let it run for a while and it will clean itself. Delusion. <laughs> Convince yourself. <laughs> that didn't happen. So the next day we call uh, we call the plumber, and the amount of shit that they found in the well outside. Disgusting. But now I'm glad to say that we have fresh water and we can take showers and brush our teeth. So that's already a first achievement. One of the rooms didn't have AC, so we had that fix. As of now, it's just a storage room for empty boxes and bags. But at some point, we hope to turn it into something nice and livable. So as you can see, it's like everything laying here, all the boxes 
the luggage that we unpacked. That's the AC unit that we installed yesterday. And one of my favorite balconies in this whole um, in this whole building. It's really spacious. And I do hope to have here some nice sitting arrangement for later on when the winter comes and it's not 50 degrees to enjoy the outside. Uh, we have to get rid of those blinds. Uh, the thing is, it is glass, so if we're gonna use it, this room for, let's say, guests, then um, it would be nice to have some privacy. So I was thinking about just putting a mud vinyl on over the windows, um, over the glass, so it can separate this room from what's on the other side. Walking downstairs, again, it's gonna be a big mess and things laying around. We have a small toilet. And again, we were doing things here yesterday, therefore there's a gigantic mess because we had to change pipes here. Same story as in all other rooms, a lot of dirt on the ceiling. So that has to be done. We need to clean all those marks from the glue and all the chemicals that were used for repairing. Uh, we still have our mirrors and frames laying around. Uh, that's the main door. Some of our furniture are already uh, put up, but most of the things are just laying in random places. Next we have kitchen and a small collection of magnets from my layovers. I don't usually buy them, I keep forgetting, so I only get them when I actually see them in the shop and I like some of them. So this one I got from the Wiesbaden layover. This one was in Egypt, Kuala Lumpur. This one is from my country. This one was from the Geneva layover, Johannesburg. This one was Spain, but I'm not sure if it, I think it was Madrid then Rome and Moscow. Uh, we need to change the taps in the sinks. We just connected the dishwasher and washing machine, so I have a pile of laundry here <laughs> that needs some washing. And then the living room. We put the couch already, we, we connected the TV, but the rest is yet to be done. We still have to put frames on the walls and in general make it more cozy and home-like because as of now it's just a gigantic mess. Uh, when it comes to the outside, yeah, that's another thing that needs fixing because normally it would have a handle like on this side, um, but it's broken there, so I guess this is this will be one of those things that we do at some point. So when it comes to the outside, this is actually the first uh, furniture that we bought already. This table is something that we really wanted. We want to make sure that at some point, once everything is done, we can have a barbecue and guests and a big table to enjoy our friends and their company. Uh, but other than that, we just put today the shade over the main entrance and we also put the bamboo fence to create a little bit more of privacy. It was just a normal fence, so we put shades here. And as you may see, there's one lamp that is broken there. We also need to either get rid of it or fix it. I'm not sure yet what we're gonna do. And we also want to plant more trees here because right now it's just dirt and ground. It's really nice for once to have a garden and the dogs are really enjoying their, their space and that they can go outside anytime. And it's also really helpful because it is very hot right now and they can actually just go outside as much as they need. And I don't have to worry that they're too hot or too long on the outside. So as you can see guys, there's a lot of things to be done. Uh, there's a lot of walls to be painted or cleaned. There's a lot of things that still needs fixing or at least cleaning and 
it just never ending it's just so so much and people keep coming every day and uh, trying to fix a different thing but at least for now we have water we have internet and we have a lovely new home that uh, with time will um, will change it to a really nice family space we have so many ideas but we're not sure exactly what's gonna be possible or what will be the final thing that we'll go for so guys thank you for watching and i hope to see you in the next one